Good morning, friends and fellow farmers. It's raining, and it is Amelia's birthday. Oh, it's also our birthday. <laughs> the 15th of summer. Uh, a good day. All right, let's see what's going on out here today. Uh, you probably want some snacks. And it is, it's well early today, too, so this is good. So last time we head out, to, we went to the islands to go kind of see what was going on out there. Because we hadn't really, uh, you know, done a great job of take, taking care of all that stuff. Still haven't done a great job of taking care of all that stuff, as far as I'm concerned. But we went and smashed some rocks and tried to get ourselves some resources. I uh, wish I could put the bike on my back and carry it out here. Okay, well, let's. So we can't do anything else, so let's. So we'll just come in and. Can't let them out. That's what I mean. They're stuck in here. I'm sorry you're stuck in here today. It'll be fine, Simon. Okay. Yep. Dusty, dusty. Alright, Isaac. And, uh, how about you there, cutie? Okay. Over to you, new three. And... I guess I gotta refill those pumps back there, or, or are they still... They haven't refilled, so maybe they're still working? I don't even know. If I could only get a couple uh, bucket loads of dirt, I could fill that chasm in. That would be nice. Hammer it. Hello there, Stormy. And... You there, Crusher. The one thing I definitely gotta get on is get on uh, fishing. <laughs> There's so many things. It, it is interesting, like I was saying in the previous episode, this game surprises me and it's, uh, like I, I definitely, I think, um, only having played this in Mineral Town in terms of the sort of Story of Seasons Harvest Moon um, thing, I, I don't really uh, have a sense of, like, like in, you know, Friends of Mineral Town, it's, it's much more simple and it's much more uh, restrained in terms of what you can do in the long run. You can just kind of farm. This there's so much to do, and I, I definitely feel busier than I felt ever in the game. Um, especially as you've opened up more regions, and there's just there's so much to be doing, and it does all it all feels kind of essential. That's the other thing. Like I don't want to shirk on my responsibilities with the critters. I don't want to leave anything. So it, in that regard, it makes me want to work more on, um, you know, getting these areas fixed up so that I, I'm able to kind of like, <laughs> I don't know, like just pave around them and make them look nicer and like less work. I need 50 aura calcum for this, right? So that's going to be the huge thing. <laughs> 50 aura calcum. That's a little bit. That's going to take me a while. And I'm just running away from all my responsibilities here. I see stuff everywhere and I'm like, oh, I just can't. Oh, I, okay, I did get the eggs. I couldn't even remember if I bothered. Okay, the last time I didn't even uh, finish up all my, all my possible stuff here. And I don't know what, uh, in terms of like my best bang for my buck with, you know, using any of these, I have no idea. I have never really worried about it. Um, oh, I still have more eggs. Okay, let's put that away. Um, yeah, definitely could use another sales chest. Like that is, that's not a thing I can build, is it? I feel like the answer to that is definitely no. I feel like I've also looked at this previously, because it's one of those things that I'm just like, man, it would be nice to be able to put a, a chest to sell stuff closer to like the animal pen so that I don't walk around with inventory. I think that's the, the only thing I find kind of like irritating is just need to ditch more inventory. <laughs> we'll get by. Okay, is this, okay, that, uh, there we go. The silver is done there. Oh. Let's, uh, I guess we'll collect what we have here. Okay. 
and here we go. So, barrage logs. A little bit more there, and a little bit more there. Okay, that's all good. Let's put away our our ridiculous quantity of stone, and let's pick up our ridiculous quantity of uh, or all all eight of our oracalcum. We're just ripping it up here. Uh, we should also process our diamonds and stuff. Let's take a look at that. Okay, so got a big machine here. Let's put our so it's 10 to complete three. Whereas, yeah, okay, and then these ones it would be ten, uh, five to complete one. So you do get an extra one. That's pretty good. Uh, just to confirm it is five to complete one. Yeah, this is 10 for three, much better use of our resources. So I guess I will try to use that as much as possible. Why do I feel like I got a giant diamond machine somewhere? These things are still cooking. Oh my gosh. Did it, okay, maybe I'm imagining it. Or maybe that's the thing that I... <laughs> These giant machines are so absurd. I don't even know. Uh, I did get a giant jewel maker. Right, but I need like a mountain of stuff. So it was like, was it worth it? Uh, I kind of went, no. That's right. Uh, let's put away our... Although to be fair, I, you know what, I'm just going to process the other stuff as is. I don't really care that much. Yeah, and then I really do... Okay, I've got fluff in here. Why do I have that in here? Let's move over. Um, guess some of these other things. Yeah, I think we're getting so much material at this point. It's okay. I can take a loss. I just want to get it processed. Oh, that's that. Okay, good. There we go. Um, I don't know. I'll just put the other stuff in here where we found it. <laughs> put it back quietly. And uh, I have more of the gems here, right? Yeah, there we go. Wow, we got a ton. I've got to use now. I guess that's silver to start building lockets and stuff. That would be a good use of my uh, my resources, perhaps. How much we have? Uh, Ninety-one bars of uh, silver. I don't feel like I have enough, like any need for it, other than that now. I gotta double check. I gotta look at what I can make. Um. No, okay, we're good. I think with everything else, let's go. Hey there, little critter. Oh my gosh, these aren't done, are they? No. Thank goodness. Okay, so let's put our spores away here. Wow. Okay, and then we'll uh, put those away. Lots of stuff to sell. This is good. Now, um... Also, I have finished kind of giving away all the good stuff I had, didn't I? Huh. And I only have two olive crystals, so that's, uh, that's not enough to do too much with. Okay. What I think I'm going to let's go into town. I'm just going to double check on things here. I, I know I need, like, an absolute boatload of money. That's, I think, the, the biggest thing really holding out on us is going to be... Um, it's Sunday. Which one of you is closed? Hey, buddy. Yeah, farm, expand house, and we're talking, yeah, a million bucks. I mean, we'll just have this stuff, I think, by the end. I think that's going to be... We're going to be there. Um... I don't think I'm going to worry about any of that. I want to go see Lovett in a second. Go see him. 
Go see, I felt like there was like one more meal or something that we needed to make. Uh, okay, so upgrade tools. Yeah, it's just everything's oracalcum, right? 150,000 of a hit, too. Uh, I don't really need any... I mean, the or the Orichalcum fishing rod would be probably nice. Um, but I need five Orichalcum for e each of these things, so they are really, really pricey. I can't upgrade that anymore. And that's it. So, yeah, just a pile of Orichalcum. So the silver is not... I need gold for the house upgrade. Silver is not really needed. So we really could use some of it for some other stuff. Hey buddy, how's it going? Small fish marinade. Uh, a white... Oh, okay, so we got a couple. Yeah, and the, the, the rewards for those are like, eh. Uh, white in color and mellow in flavor. <laughs> white in color and mellow in flavor. Small fish marinade, Neapolitan pasta. Hey buddy. The only thing Simber Jamboree lacks is scrumptious food. Why don't you fix that? That is a that's a you thing. You could definitely be working on the scrumptious food. Well that's interesting this tool shop has like stuff on display in the side window. Like, that's a bold choice, like nobody's gonna steal that. Um Oh. Oh, maybe we actually hit a cutscene here. No, it's uh, Sydney. Hodge. Just who I wanted to see. Seeing how you're the one of the newest residents in this town, I have a request for you. So this might sound odd, but could you ask people what they think of my husband? <laughs> oh yes, Norman's such a nice man. We buy all our ingredients from his shop, actually. He's always got such great products lined up. It's been a big help for me in the cafe. Oh, Norman? We'll talk every once in a while about movies and such. He hardly leaves the shop, but I'm always manning the hotel, though. It's like we both work 24-7. But I'd like to grab a meal with him sometime. Tell him that for me, would you? Clements. Norman, yeah, I spot him fishing every so often. As far as I can tell, though, I don't think he manages to catch that many fish. Tell me once he's happiest when he's just relaxing outside, since he's almost always indoors managing the store. Heh, <laughs> that's a sentiment I can relate to for sure. So we got a town of workaholics, that's what we have. Sydney, it sounds like he's doing well for himself here. I'm glad to hear that. Sorry I had to go through all the trouble. I can only come out here on my days off, so I worry from time to time if he's getting along with the other town folk. But it seems like my worries were misplaced. Everyone seems to like him. Anyway, I'm grateful for your help. Alright. <laughs> poor, poor Norman. I feel bad for him now. It's like, I mean, she's concerned, but, you know. Dude's working 24-7. Mm -hmm. Happy birthday. Oh, thank you. It's not even my special day, but it might be as well be considering how happy it makes me to celebrate all things Hodge. Aw, thank you. That's very nice. Uh, I don't have a special gift to give you today unless you want my Oracalcum hammer. Or my confession pendant, but apparently we're not there yet, so... I've got to, uh, i got to earn that. Alright. Let's get... Oh! Did I... I stumbled into another cutscene. Oh! Huh? What do you want? You're here to see me? That's nice and all, but I'm still in the job. I've got to make sure this trash is picked up. I look like I was spacing out. Yeah, I guess you could say that. I was just thinking about everything that's been going on recently. It's great that there's more tourists. I'm thrilled about it, really, but more tourists means more garbage to pick up. I like helping out tourists because I love the ocean. I want to share all it's got to offer, but our beaches get trashed in the process. It stinks, literally. You'll help me out? You better bet I'll take you up on that offer. No backing out now, you hear me? Okay, I haven't even started over there yet, so let's get to it. Whew, that goes so much faster with two people. I guess it's harder to get sidetracked by gloomy thoughts when someone else has your back. Huh? I thought it was trash, but it's a seashell. Hey, come over here. The water feels great. Wet sand is the best feeling in the world. Are you a fan of the ocean? That's great. Maybe we've got more in common than I thought. <laughs> this is the most awkward uh, dating that we've... Congratulations, you can finally come... <laughs> Oh my gosh, really? Picking up trash and then uh, both we both like sand in our toes. Uh, you can finally confess your love to the special someone by confession. Okay, well we did that. Let's uh, get on our moped and 
That is ridiculous. Again, it's it, it's unintentionally funny, but it still makes me laugh. Here we go. Huh? I'm touched, thanks. But hold on a sec, I need to get my thoughts in order. How are you going to do that? What's the problem? You love Hodge too, don't you? You shouldn't keep him in the dark about it, says Masaki. Yeah, I do, but I was finally getting the hang of my tour job. Ah, I can't. Dad still needs help with the store, and I gotta make sure I keep up with Mom over the phone, and... Well, if you're having trouble with all that, then you can't overwhelm yourself with too much, I suppose. Right? That's just how you are, and that's alright. But what happens if we date and decide we aren't cut out for each other? You'll just have to cross that bridge when you get to it. It makes sense a lot easier than it actually is. If things don't work out, I don't know, it'd be tough to bounce back from something like that. You'll be fine, Laura. Hodge is a good guy. I think you'd be perfect together. Ho oh. ho. Oh, welcome. I assume you're here for Laura, says Masaki. Well, I'll leave you two alone for a while, so tell him what you want to do. Um, sorry for reacting like that. It was so sudden that it caught me off guard, but I love you too, Hodge. If you're good with me, then I'll be happy to be your girlfriend. <laughs> Commitment made. That was, uh, that was a lot for that. I thought we were being married at the end of that. New title, Time to Confess. What are we confessing? Bridget, what are we confessing? I, I had nothing to do with the Inquisition. Wow, congrats on winning the Summer Jamboree. Thank you. Hey, Masaki, thanks for helping out. I wonder if everyone was satisfied with their performance. <laughs> I won, yet I still feel empty. Sighed Masaki. I still feel deeply saddened. Have I won? Or have I just lost? We'll, we, we'll never know. Uh, let's get... Oh, Norman. Eviscerate Victor. Come to think of it, huh? What's going on, Victor? Well, hello there. Something just occurred to me. You see, we don't have any particular name for the beach here. So should we give it one? I've been looking at maps and every beach I find on them has some sort of eye-catching name. But our beach is completely nameless. I can't help but feel bad for the thing. I must have a sense for the eye-catching as a former city slicker. What do you take a shot at naming it? Sh -sh shore b -b 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 beach Wahaha -ha 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 Waterfront? Uh, wah -ha -ha waterfront? Wah-ha-ha-ha-ha waterfront. Not bad, personally speaking, at least. Huh? Any other bright ideas? Uh, b -b 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 like, these are terrible. But that sounds so tiring, makes me want to yawn. Well, how do I put this? To be frank, I'm starting to reconsider asking for your help. Yeah, you should. Perhaps I should never have asked. Perhaps this has been the greatest mistake of my entire life. It, one of them. Yokopo maybe tops. The, what? You have a few other ideas that you've been saving until now? Fine, let's hear them. Uh, bu -bu 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 Peach. I regret everything. You should. And I should be ashamed at uh, making. Uh, it's like, why would I do a stuttering name that seems like I, you're mocking things? That just seems horrible. I, maybe we're a terrible person. Beth wants a lump of coal for 400G. Beth, I'm not going to give that to you because you should not be wasting 400 coal. I'm going to be judging how you spend your cash, and that's a ridiculous use of your income. Also, I'm not coming all the way back out here for 400G for a lump of coal. That's also a waste of my time. So let's save me both, both you and I, the effort, and uh, not do that. Oh, Beth. Uh, you know what Beth wants it for is some incredible sort of like... Uh, steampunk thing she's got going on. It's a mech that's going to take over the town. But it's it's coal-powered for reasons. Alright, uh, let's check out stuff. Okay, can I harvest? No. Oh wait, did it? No, that was Buddy gave me a thing. Oh my gosh, okay, so there's a lot of stuff happening here. Oh. I feel like there's Okay, harvest all... There we go, boom! Oh, I could have done... Let's get a better job of that. Let me just move my, my weightlifting over to the other region here. I see, so if I just go to the bottom of the quadrant... Oh, it's not even a quadrant, what do you call this? I don't even know what you call it. It's... Well, some of them are, have more, I guess, because they don't have sprinklers. Alright. Um, oh, that's all busy. Uh, 
There we go. Okay, and then back over here. Oh my gosh. Can you kind of... Oh, you can. Yeah, once you get going there, you can sort of situate it more properly. Okay, so we got like 33 of our little friend coins now. Okay, so that stuff's not up. Uh, this stuff is, though. Come on. Pizza eggs. There we are. <laughs> okay, so we have a few things we could plant here. Um, now, I'm not even sure what I want to... Like, what do we want to make more seeds of? Uh, I have more strawberry seeds. Yeah, I don't even... Okay. Uh, those are 10 gold... Yeah, these are good strawberries. Oh boy. Okay, so let's put in... There we go. We'll make we'll make some more strawberries. Uh, I'm going to sell these ones. I'm going to plant these ones. Uh, turnip. I don't know. I'm just going to grab a bunch of seeds. Yeah. All right. We really don't have that much space here. I don't know what I'm trying to accomplish. Oh, I forgot to harvest this. Nice. Got harvest points. Okay, well, we're back on uh, the case over here. Wow. Okay, and then we're on to onions. And I can probably load up the rest of this, can't I? We'll like have just a little bit more than we need. Oh, and it looks like I did not harvest this here. There we go. We have so much fodder, it is ridiculous. Okay, uh, that all looks pretty good. So let's dump off this now. Uh, I'm just going to dump off the fodder because I do not want it. We will leave the rest of our seeds here. Um, hmm. I think we're doing okay. Um, take these giant turnips. I've planted more turnips. So that's good. We'll, uh, we'll get that going. Uh, I believe I planted more garlic. So I'm going to just sell that. Yeah, I think we're okay. Um, everything else will get seed made on its own terms. Return to the farm. I, I do feel like it's it's almost best to like take on one season a day or something, maybe. I need to get a routine going with it. Because it's a lot. But we're going to make an, an absolute killing here, I feel like. Uh, there we go. We're at 10 grand. 20 grand. 45 grand, 48,000, 50,000, and uh, we're 50,900 today. That's a pretty good day. <laughs> I have a feeling that is a very good day. Uh, four o'clock, what else do we want to get done here? I definitely need to make some decisions about like our overall layout and stuff. I feel like now that we're getting closer to being kind of organized, like, sort of organized. That's sort of the next stage. Um, but I'm also still... Yeah. <laughs> okay, and then uh, let's get... Okay, let's get clear out a few things here, because this is kind of, once again, out of control. All right. So yeah, in terms of like, I know where where do we want to lay down resources and um, this whole area, yeah, it's it's a weird one because we're definitely we're not at a point where I want to make like jumbo makers for everything yet because we don't have uh, I'm still saving all that those excess resources so that one is a little bit hard. I, I would like to, but I'd also like to like have leftover, you know. 
um, uh, resources to actually finish some quests and stuff, so. Uh, not yet. Okay, trees. Sorry. No, no, you. And I, I feel like I might need to get a bucket out. Because we're getting a little bit... Uh, there we go. To be fair though, it is really easy to like clear out everything. It's not hard. Uh, you know that stuff I'm just going to leave. I really don't need up there at this point. Okay, let's... Now we'll... The sickle is good. Uh, even the golden sickle is nice, I guess. The thing is, that's... I don't, I don't absolutely need the... Uh, you know... Oh, I want to come over here more. Uh, having oil or calcum everything is kind of like a nice to have, but not absolutely essential. It's still pretty good. Okay, there we go. Come on. All right. There we go. And uh, I don't know. I guess I'll take out a bucket where it's because why not? Clear out some of this stuff. If we have the energy, I guess we may as well. Not that I want the uh, the bin here. All right, and then we'll come back and just clear these out. At least we know we've already we have these, so it's not like we're getting excessive amounts of anything. Okay, yeah, and then I'll have to take the stone and really think about, like, the stone path thing. Let's see what we can do here. Um, I, like, I don't know how much my stuff I'm going to have to, like, pick up and move or... Uh, yeah, what's the best method of going about it? I don't really want to just make, like, a giant stone plaza here. Although, I mean, if we can lay stuff on top of it, maybe I would. It would help me keep this place looking cleaner. It is funny that these... This idea of artificial order, it's like a green lawn or something. It's like a completely arbitrary idea. Like really, it's not going to change anything here. But it does save us a little bit of effort later. No more maintenance. I guess that's the thing. We're trying to go maintenance free. Oh, no, we can't do both. Eight o'clock almost. That uh, it always takes longer than I expect to clear out stuff. Oh. Okay, and then, like, bud, you know there's nothing there. So why are you? Why are the pretense of like pretending? I'm scooping water. No, you're not. We know you're not. Stop pretending. You're just wasting energy. Okay. Um, and then we had some sickling to do here. And another. It's these things. Every day, like, I think, oh, we're done. <laughs> we have like 8,000 other things to do. It's astounding. Okay, and then, uh, that's gotta be just about it, right? I think that's mostly it. What is that? Oh, that, uh, I've seen that owl, have I not? Pretty certain I have. It's probably the, th the one thing I haven't seen yet. Um, okay, that's kind of, oh no, hold up. More peppercorn here. Gotta get processing that in due time. Okay, and then it's pretty much all wood. Uh, I don't know what I was doing with the arthrite. Okay. So, yeah, I've got a whole mount of the stone road already. <laughs> Oop. Uh, 
Okay, so you can't... I can put it in between these rows. Uh, I guess I'd have to lift the machines up. I, I still don't know if I can put it down on top of the thing. Uh, clear away. Okay, let's put some stuff down. I'm kind of just curious if I can, like... I would imagine I could. Alright, and then we'll... This place is going to be so sterile. <laughs> if I can do this. No. <laughs> okay, I think I've tried this before. Well, that's really annoying. Uh, how do I clear this up? Oh. Oh, I just pull it up. I see it. Well, at least it's easy to clear. And I can't, like... Wow. All right. And it's funny that you can't place this on floors. All right, and that's that. Wow. And we'll call it a day. That's, uh, yeah, that's bananas. I'll have to figure out how else to make it all kind of look nice. I mean, we got to do something with it. Um, whatever, I don't even I need to go put some stuff uh, away and go open some bags of things, open some goodies. Hey, right, kitty cats. All right, let's get some sleep and uh, we will see you all next time. Till then, bye-bye.